Hey guys, it's Rachel C. Let's start off with some acapella news. Last week was Denmark's Aarhus Music Festival. This festival celebrated acapella on a global scale. Groups came from all over Europe, parts of Africa, and the U.S. to share a variety of different musical styles. There were groups who performed more traditional and cultural vocal music, as well as those who broke the barrier with vocal electronic performances. Special thanks to Bill Hare for all the amazing footage. The next festival is in 2015, so start saving now. Check out his full review of the weekend in the show notes. In other news, NPR radio show All Things Considered interviewed Deke Sharon on contemporary acapella. Listen to the broadcast in the show notes. Canada's Cothwa Park Chamber Choir is celebrating their 25th anniversary. To celebrate, this student-run a cappella group is sharing their next stage with rock icons the Rolling Stones. Read more about their roots in the show notes. CASA is updating their a cappella encyclopedia, or Acapedia. Check out the CASA Facebook blog for more information on how you can contribute. In this week's Too Many Notes, we've got Deke Sharon answering some viewer questions. Welcome to Too Many Notes. This edition will be devoted to viewer mail. All right, our first letter is from Los Angeles, and it asks, Dear Too Many Notes, does increased exposure to auto-tune improve intonation overall? Let me dumb that down a bit for you. Does modern robotic pop music mean that people are singing in tune more often? Hmm. Answer, no way. Actually, I think it's making singers lazier because they're spending less time in rehearsal and more time recording themselves and then making it seem like they spent more time in rehearsal. So no, it's not in better tune, it's actually in more precise, well-tempered, slightly out of tune tune. Go ask a barber shopper. They'll explain it to you. All right, time for our next question. How do you deal with a not so great singer that thinks they're all that and they're bringing the group down? How do you deal with them without destroying them? My answer, destroy them. Little by little by little by... Destroy them as much as necessary to bring their ego down to a manageable place where you can let them know they're not that great and then help them start working towards being great. Entitlement does nobody any favors. Great takes time, it takes energy, it takes hard work. When ego exceeds talent and preparation, you got a problem. You gotta bring the ego down. There's just no way around it. And ultimately, long term, you're doing that person a big favor. And if they can't handle it, they don't belong in the group. All right, here's a great question. How do you make sure a group is excellent on stage and recorded? My answer is this. Make sure the group is great on stage first. If a group is great on stage, there's a very good chance that will translate very well to a recording. Get good at music in front of people because that's the whole point of music. Music is communication. Then take that music into the recording studio. Your engineer, editor, mixer, and master will all send you Hallmark thank you cards. All right, one more question. Dear Too Many Notes, why don't you just use instruments instead of imitating them? Hmm. Dear viewer, why does anybody bother sounding like an instrument with their voice? Simple. Because then your hands are free. Look, you only need one hand to grasp the microphone, and the other hand you can make trumpet motions, or guitar motions, or if you have something in your hair, you can pick it out, or if you have an itch, you can scratch it. Uh-huh, yeah. That's right. You know what I'm saying. That's all for this week. If you have any questions, go ahead and post them down below, or send an email in to deke at deeksharon.com, and I will gladly answer it in an upcoming edition of Too Many Notes. To end this week's show, we've got a featured video from the UK's The Boxettes, Puppet on a String. Thanks for watching Inside Acapella. Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel for more acapella updates and check out our Facebook and Twitter for more insider information. I'm Rachel C, and I'll see you next week. Control me like a toy, now it's time to cut the puppet from the string.